Welcome, in this video, you will learn two methods for identifying free edges. These solutions can be used in a preventive manner or to resolve meshing issues, as shown in the accompanying example. The free edges are used to identify free and non-manifold edges present in a given body but, we will only talk about free edges in this video. The term free edge is used to describe a bar element that is connected to only one other element. This is highlighted in orange. We will start by importing the model, you will find the CAD and the mesh body we are going to work with. You can see that it is made up of two elements, the carrier and the cover, both independent of each other. Check free edges and fill holes. If you didn't get an error and want to check for free edges, go to Mesh. Verify. And select Edges. Choose a body to see existing free edges. Fix them by going to Geometry. Face and clicking on the Fill icon. Select Mesh. Body Type. And click OK. If you get a message saying the model is invalid, just select the body again. And click OK. This will apply the solution. You can then use merge faces to make the created elements part of a parent face. Manual element creation. One indication that there are free edges in our model is the error message that appears when you attempt to apply a volume mesh, as shown. This will immediately display a window with the error. Or you can access the output window for further details. From here, you can remove all the free edges manually using the tool from the modify section of the mesh ribbon. As you can see, you can create triangles, quadrilaterals, and so on. Once created, SimLab will indicate when all the edges have been resolved. Finally, we will update the topology for the visible models. You can access this option in Geometry, Model, and Update. or by right-clicking on a model in the model browser.